What's up guys, welcome back to our Road to Dark Matter series. Today, as requested by Popular Gamer, we're gonna be using the Burst SMG. So let's see what gun that is. Hmm. Okay, so it's so it's not the Milano. It's not the AK-74U. Not the Bullfrog. It's not the Mac 10. Erm. Scratch his chin. I guess we're doing the KSP. The funny thing about this comment is that it wasn't even the most liked comment on the video. There were actually two comments that had more likes. So if you guys leave a comment, even if it's something stupid, completely unrelated to the video or something, you can leave a weapon suggestion in there and you just might pick the next gun for the video. I haven't seen you guys request the KSP a lot, so it's, it's about time that we're finally doing it. Uh, I'm not going to go through and count how many to determine whether or not what gun we're going to be using next. It, it finally happened. We're on it. So anyways, I thought I figured out the best way for point blanks. Like I personally didn't figure it out. I don't know why I said I figured it out, but you guys have been suggesting, oh, just play fire team dirty bomb. Just play dirty bomb. Go in there and get unsuspecting people, people that aren't paying attention. So I tried that. And for the first game, it was great. I think I got like maybe 15 point blanks. But I played two more games after that. I was getting nothing. I was I was maybe getting like five or six or something, which it, I mean, it's good. But for the time it takes to play a full dirty bomb game, like if you leave, you can lose progress. So you playing the full game of dirty bomb, it just outweighs that. And then I don't know, if you have a good game of dirty bomb, it's worth it to do the point blanks, but if it's a bad game, it's really bad. It, you, you don't want to play it. After all that, I wouldn't I play a game on Nuketown? Let's check my after action report. Can I see my medals? I just got 19 in one game. So I'm going to be showing you guys today how you can get point blanks pretty easily. And I think we've been overthinking this challenge a lot. So I'm pulling up the KSP here. I'm going to show you guys my camos first and I'll show you the loadout. We're only two point blank kills away. I usually, I play a few games like before I record to make sure like the camos are close enough to... So like getting gold in the episode is like achievable, right? I played one game on Nuketown and got 20 of them. So it's pretty ridiculous. We also just need a, a few long shots, but nothing hardcore can't fix. And you know, a, a few kills while enemies are detected. I mean, nothing, nothing too crazy, but we, we are flying through point blanks. So here's the loadout we have. I have the axial arms, three times scope. I have the 10 and a half inch task force barrel. We have the SWAT five milliwatt laser, the bruiser grip and the 48 round fast mag now this has been going absolutely nuts for me the one game i played on nuketown it was a hard point game hard points goaded by the way and it, we just completely demolished point blank so we only need two more so we're gonna try to do that and then we're gonna focus on long shots i i don't know if we just play a hardcore game because we can get the two point blanks and then focus on long shots the rest of the game but i kind of want to show i really want to show you guys this method and it's actually really simple rest of the class you need stun grenades for this. Tomahawks, field mic, and then we have perk greed on, so it's flag jacket, attack mask, quartermaster, scavenger, and then gung ho and ninja. Th the method I've been, I've been, I've been talking about, I've been praising, is just this: stun, walk up, shoot. I mean that that wasn't a very good example, but look at this. Look, you, you just kind of oh, I didn't get it there. What happened to my lights? Okay, so. Earlier, I was I was so ready to just make the video on like, oh, play fire team, get point blanks. Because I just had such a good first game. But every game after that was so bad. Look, there's another one. You literally just run. You run and shoot. Like gung-ho, it's just sprint. The KSP, actually very, very good close range. Look at that. And it's done. Point blank's done. We just win and knocked out too that easy. Look, there's another one. Just, just for good measure. But point blanks, I really think everyone's been... Just overthinking them. Yeah, they can be frustrating. And I I know like it, SPMM and lobbies, everything like differentiates and it's hard to get. Sometimes when you're playing against really good players, it's hard to get like in on them. But like if you're having trouble, maybe play new, let's say you're playing Nuketown, you're having trouble. Okay, switch to, to Dirty Bomb, play a game of that. Maybe, maybe two games. I don't know, those games take forever. Like play a game or two and then just switch modes. Cause I, I played Fireteam out of like the five games, I got like 30 point blank kills, maybe. And like, even if you kill them point blank, they go down and you have to kill them while they're down. And sometimes like their teammates can come in and intervene or they have self revive or something, or you just get picked off from somewhere else. Like I could have had a few more point blanks, I think. But then I had 20 just on a game of Nuketown. They're running, throwing a stun and just pulling up on them like that. But like as, as long as you have tack mask on and you're just tossing stuns like this, maybe tack mask danger close probably be better if you're, that's what you're focusing. But I like to have ninja and gung ho. It just makes it so much easier to get up on people. I don't know. Maybe I got really lucky, but this is, I think this is going to be my last SMG besides the Mac 10, but you know, technically you don't need to do that. And I, and I have seen that you can just do a DLC gun and for the other normal guns. Cause I think you just need five SMGs to get diamond. 
Like it doesn't matter if they're DLC or not. I already had this bad boy leveled up. But after after almost having diamond SMGs, like this the easiest point blanks I've gotten is just running and stunning. Like eventually eventually you'll get in a lobby where people will let you get close. You'll, you'll get in a lobby with players who don't really care that much. And you'll you'll just be in there picking up point blanks all you want. We have a lot of long shots to go. I don't, I don't think it'll be that difficult. Hardcore makes it so easy. Just stay on this side and that's a long shot. That's just a normal kill. I'm putting a stim on. We don't need to stun people anymore. All right, we're trying the garage. That works. That works. That works. Garage kind of sick. Until it's not. Okay, yeah, I, I'm liking this garage spot. I'm just going to sit here. Don't care how long it takes. This guy can't contest it. What are you going to do against it? Just die? Or I'll die. That could work. And I'll just come back and kill you. Why are you trying to slow peek it? I've been sleeping on this garage spot. This is kind of crazy. It's just nothing but long shots and it's so safe. He tried to crawl in. He's trying so many opportunities. He's like trying to slow peek it left. I'm in right. He tried to crawl in that time. And so many options. You just getting the dick. I like going for long shots and stuff because you see the same people doing it on the other team. It's just you're dueling out, dueling it out with them to get camos. Anyone goes in this garage, they die except for that guy. I'll let that guy go. And him. They get a pass. That's my teammate. Hey, we got Cherry Blossom done. Oh, we got diamond. I didn't even realize it. Let's go. I guess we finished long shots. That's another diamond, baby. I'll, I'll give you guys one of these. Let me try to put it towards the camera. All right. So we finally got another class diamond. Let's see how it looks on the KSP. That's still, I mean, better gold spread than a lot of the guns. I it, Diamond's diamond. We'll take it. We're only three weapon classes away. Jeez. We're, we're flying through it now. Here are my weapon mastery calling cards. As you can see, we got SMGs, snipers, special, and launchers diamond. So anything from those categories, don't recommend it unless it's like the MAC-10 or something. Because we, we already got it completed. And then here, here's the rest of them. You know, AK, FFR. We, we're, we're really close on uh, ARs. I don't think we have a single LMG yet. But yeah, uh, I showed you guys the receipts at the beginning of the video. That my, that method for point blanks just works. Just stun people. Gung-ho, ninja, stun. And you, you get point blanks. It's We've definitely been overthinking it. At least I have for sure. You can try out Fireteam Dirty Bomb. That, that works pretty well too. Good games are good. Bad games are really bad. Like you, you will not get any and you'll have, or you'll get a few and you'll have to play out the whole game. So yeah, you know, take, take that advice with a grain of salt. But yeah, we're, we're done with the SMGs besides the Mac 10. So uh, if you liked the video, leave a like on it. If you didn't, dislike. Uh, if you're new here, leave a sub. And yeah, don't forget to uh, leave a comment for your suggestion. If you see somebody already commented what gun you want to see me do next, just thumb it up. I want the most likes will be the gun that we're doing next. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.